Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So I'm gonna start off the video by showing y'all that I'm still doing my cook at home challenge. Um, in my previous video, I showed y'all what I was eating for breakfast. I think I did. And then for lunch, I ate leftovers from um, Sunday dinner. And today we are having chicken fettuccine alfredo with broccoli so that's my husband's plate and i'm so mad because i forgot to um get garlic bread or garlic knots while we were at the grocery store anyway and then my son's plate let me turn around and my son he doesn't really like chicken to be in his pasta so i just mm -hmm. did um noodles alfredo noodles and uh grapes just, look he ready he just ready. so we about to eat our dinner i just pulled up in front of the eye doctor place i am due for my annual eye exam so i'm gonna go in here and listen to the eye doctor tell me how progressively worse my eyesight has gotten <laughs> but yeah that's usually how that goes i love this eye doctor i used to have a fear of going to the eye doctor because when I was younger, I had a traumatic experience um, where I went to this eye doctor and you know how they have like the eye pressure machine where they test your eye pressure and they put like the the air in your eyes. And so like that messed me up my whole psyche like for a minute. And even now to this day, like I hate getting that done. And so for years I had put off getting my eyes examined and stuff. But for the last couple years, I've been getting back on track and going to the eye doctor as I should. But you know, I need to be putting these benefits uh, to work. You know what I'm saying? I pay for the insurance. I might as well go to the doctor and stuff. But yeah, I usually get a prescription. I get two prescriptions, one for contacts and one for eyeglasses because I love wearing contacts, but sometimes I like to give my eyes a break. So I'll put on my glasses as well. And then in the past, I wasn't wearing my contacts properly. Like I would, um, what is it called? I would sleep in my contacts, which you're not supposed to do and stuff like that. So that's another reason why I got glasses. And then the uh, type of contacts that I get I'll put the name of the brand that I get, but yeah, they're like a monthly, I think. So like you can wear them for a month. Of course you got to take them out at night, but you can wear them for a month and then you discard them and then, you know, you start a new pack and it's very interesting because one of my, my eyes are not identical. Like one of my eyes is weaker than the other one. So the prescriptions in my glasses and my contacts. I gotta make sure, especially with my contacts, that if something's labeled for the right eye, I put that in the right eye, and then the one that's labeled for the left eye, I put it for the left eye. Like, I can't switch them because one eye is weaker than the other one. And um, I do suffer from, from astigmatism, and I'm nearsighted, so I can't see things far away. So yeah, my eyesight is jacked. And I be asking my eye doctor all the time, like, is there anything that I can do to like, you know, correct my vision or whatever she's like no nah, not really like <laughs> it just happens but yeah i also like to get when I, I order my glasses online i don't like to get glasses at the eye doctor because they be hella expensive so i just get the prescription and i go on like zenny optical and different places like that y'all probably see a video that i had previously where i had, was unboxing some eyeglasses or whatever but yeah like those places are much cheaper and then i got benefits to where i buy my eyeglasses i can get the money right back so yeah i just rather do that and plus they like more spot stylish and stuff like that and i get the glasses with the um i think it's for like blue light or something you know it's supposed to help you when you're spending a lot of time looking at um screens and stuff because that's what i do i'm always on the computer because of my work because of my job and then also editing for youtube and stuff so i like to get something that um helps with that because that can mess up your eyesight too <sighs> but yeah that can mess up your eyesight too i'm trying to think is there anything else uh no nothing else that i really need to 
talk to y'all about but yeah usually the appointment goes really fast which i'm hoping it does because i got a busy day today but and hopefully it's not a lot of people in there either they're usually really good with spacing this all out and taking our temperatures and stuff when we go in but yeah definitely have to have a mask going in here because they're gonna be like you can't come up in here like you gotta buzz and everything for them to unlock the door they don't play to leave the eye doctor had to get stronger prescription for both my glasses and my contacts luckily i just told him just to give me my prescription and the guy was like don't you want to get what your um, insurance is paying for paying for it as far as um like getting my glasses or whatever through there i'm like no i'm gonna get that anyway i got my detailed receipt i'm gonna get my insurance to cover my visit today and also you know, whatever glasses I order online, they're going to pay for that, too. But um, I love my eye doctor. She's very patient with me. Matter of fact, I followed her because she was at uh, one eye place, and then she moved to this um, particular office. And so I've been coming to this center to see her. And also, I see um, a male eye doctor. And he's really nice, too. And so... The two receptionists that were helping me was first a woman when I first got there. She was really nice. And then a man checked me out. They were nice. But it was this other one up in there. She had a nasty thing attitude. She was like talking over me. And she was basically like she didn't have time for me. She directed me to the man. And yeah, she was like, why is she over here? Da -da 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 -da. So I was just like, I gave her a nasty look when I left out. <laughs> I really wanted to say something to her, like, for real. But I was like, you know what? To me, people up in here, let me just leave. But, yeah, so I'm getting ready to head back to work. Well, I'm about to get, head back home and get online for work because we got a meeting coming up. It's going to be like a couple hours or so. So it's cool. I'm just going to be making up time. But, yeah, like, I just hate when people that work in customer service are like rude and nasty because I worked in customer service too I've been there and I've done that and I know how it could be but like you gotta treat each encounter with the different people that you come across you know you gotta treat it as its own unique thing you know what I'm saying like you can't let what happened with another patient or customer affect how you treat the next person you know what I'm saying like that lady had no reason to be so rough and brush me off like that you know what I'm saying so I do fill out customer surveys whenever they come through and I be very detailed and I let them know like hey Susie at the front desk had a snotty snotty attitude and I leave I leave reviews too now you know whatever people are looking for places to go to I, I will put on there I do positive and bad experiences don't get me wrong I don't just go online and leave reviews that are negative i also leave positive reviews that's why i'm telling y'all the positive stuff about this particular office that i go to like you know it's not everybody it's just one bad apple <laughs> but one bad apple can spoil the bunch you know what i'm saying but I'm, I'm just trying to release that negative energy i don't need that on me for the rest of the day but yeah i do have a pair of contacts in right now like i said she had to bump up my prescription so that's why i don't have my glasses on right now because y'all probably like hold up tish you about to start driving you ain't got your glasses on like no i have i have my contacts in my new prescription i just got to order some more like usually i i sit there at the doctor's office and i like put in an order so that they can ship it to me but because that lady was so nasty to me i'm gonna just like order the contacts online just like i order um, my glasses online and luckily i can do that
So I can't decide between whether or not I want to buy some glasses from Zenny Optical or Firmu. I have a Firmu video on my channel. But this is Zenny Optical. They let me do like a virtual 3D try on. I just wanted to show y'all me with these different glasses on. This is funny. But yeah, saying that I have an oval shaped face because my chin is narrow. You hear my husband over there giggling. I'm trying to figure out which ones I like. Surprisingly, I like these look good, but it looks like they have like the nose guard, the nose uh, pads. I don't like those because, you know, they leave indentions in your face. But yeah, this is cool. Usually I upload pictures. That's what I did on Firmu. I have an old picture that I uploaded on there where I was looking and seeing which ones I might be interested in. But yeah, on Zenny. Ooh, what about these? You see how they have the rim on the top and then the bottom is clear? Let me see. Oh, and they come in pink. For some reason, I have been kind of feeling the pink. I am surprised that something like this looks good on me and the tortoise shell is not that bad and the price is $23.95 they both got sales going on right now and Zenny's glasses are priced as they are on the website I think Firmu has like a buy one get one fifty percent off but that may just be for first time um, purchasers I may just buy one from each website because I like these these are nice and then Firmu so these are the glasses on Firmu that I like these ones are pink slash clear and I really like those too and see those are $40 I have a very um high prescription so my my stuff is like extra and then I get like blue light and UV coating and stuff on my lenses. So that's going to bring my total up. But yeah, I think I'm going to go with this pair from Firmu because I really like them. And I'm going to probably go with the other pair from Zenny as well. And you see these ones, high quality frame, basic prescription lenses, anti-scratch coating and UV protection. Yeah, I like these. I'm going to select these two because I like to try to get at least two pairs of glasses whenever I'm ordering. But yeah, I need the lenses with the vision correction. All right. All right, y'all. So I just ordered my two pairs of glasses. Can't wait for them to come in. I did leave a referral code down in the description box for firmu.com that you all can use if y'all are interested in getting something from their website. I would get a commission, I think, if you decide to use the code. And Zenny, I was looking to see if they had a refer co referral code, but I didn't see any. And I also, before I, uh, you know, pay for my purchases or whatever, I did look for some coupon codes. So I was able to find a 30% off 30% off frames code for Firmu, and I was able to find, I think it was free shipping or something like that for Zenny. So any little bit helps. And yeah, I, anytime I make an online purchase, I try to make sure I can find some discount codes or coupon codes or something. But yeah, I hope that you all enjoyed this video. If so, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And don't forget to click that notification bell so that you'll be notified every time I make an upload. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Ooh.